nightmare. Gosh. Well, you know, we've heard about hackers getting into your phones, computers, tablets, but what about your cars? Haley Rush with the Fox 12 Investigators joins us to talk about a recent report warning consumers about just that. The report was released by a California-based consumer advocate group. To be clear, it's talking about newer cars only that have internet connection, but they worry one day those will be the only cars we own. Imagine driving down the road when all of a sudden you don't have control of your car anymore, but someone else does remotely. That's the image painted in a report called Kill Switch, released by the nonprofit Consumer Watchdog. And the security that's in these cars is no better than what's on a wireless phone, what's on a, an Android device or an iPhone. And that's not good enough. President of Consumer Watchdog Jamie Court says they spent months talking with a group of car industry technologists and engineers who wanted to remain anonymous out of fear of losing their jobs. Their concern, newer car models with internet connection. The danger is these connections can be hacked. And when the connections can be hacked, your car can be hacked and someone can take control of that car. And you've probably seen some of the videos online showing what a hack could look like. This one here shows a Jeep being steered. And then this one here shows a Tesla being controlled remotely. So what's so scary is that we have cars with an internet connection directly to the brakes, the steering, uh, the engine, to safety critical systems. And the technologists we work with say that's just not a safe design. A lot of the top car brands in the U.S. already sell internet connected cars. We're just hitting the tip of the iceberg with it too. There's, you know, the cars are just coming onto the roads that are, you're not going to be able to buy a car pretty soon that doesn't have a connection. And like its name, the report recommends a kill switch be provided by automakers so drivers can disconnect their cars from the internet in a second. It's cheap, it's easy. A cheap and easy start that court says could save lives. We did reach out to a number of automakers to get their reaction about the report. They all told me cybersecurity is a priority. You can read their responses and what they say they're doing to protect drivers at kptv.com. In studio, Haley Rush, Fox 12 Oregon. All right, let's get back.